howdy folks. I'm Cooter Buck Shooter, the one and only. Today I'm here to tell you folks how to be a real redneck. There's some people that think they are, but they just don't know the real steps. Well don't you worry, we got those steps for you today. And boy, I hope you listen, because if you want to be a real redneck, you'll follow these steps. Now let's go and see what we got in store. Step one, make sure you wear camo to school. How are you two doing? Good. Right on, brothers. Yeah. <laughs> Heck yes. Step two, drive that big old diesel of yours to school and park in the back. my big old diesel school. That's what we boys do in the south. Step three, make sure your fun-loving girlfriend wears camel with you. Baby, you're my keeper. I want you forever. Yeah. Always load your hunting stories with a bunch of bull crap. I'm telling you, I was walking through the woods and I seen what must have been a 50 point buck. Biggest thing I ever seen. So, me being the experienced hunter I am, quick, pulled up my gun, set my sight on the sum gun, and I let her go. The doggone thing did a backflip, landed on the doggone feet, it took off. I said, well, heck, better go look for him. Never found him. Till this day, I don't know what happened to old 50 Point, but I know he's still out there, rotting away, Wait for me to find him. Don't matter where you is, always wear them daggum hunting boots. Mama, get your dang boots off the table before I come over there and whip you up behind. I'm sorry, Mama. Oh, I've done a bad thing. Ooh. Make sure your cousin and your girlfriend are the exact same thing. Well, come on, shoot that crater. Hell yeah. <laughs> Nice shot, cousin. You mean girlfriend? Oh, yeah! <laughs> I don't even care if you were born in the north, raised in Canada, I don't care. If you want to be a redneck, you need to show your Confederate C and you need to show off your Confederate flag. Now that y'all know all these steps, have a little bubbly feeling in your stomach, you know what I'm saying? God, you should feel inspired, like you need to go out and shoot a deer or something, or at least tell somebody that you shot one. You need to get out there, you need to show them hillbilly boys that they ain't real rednecks. You're a real redneck now, alright? Show them what you're made of. Man, you got hair in your chest, you got hair on your legs, you got hair on your face because you are redneck and you love the South. I don't care. Heck, you can be up in Antarctica or Antarctica. I don't know which one's up there, but you know what? You'll always be a southern boy. And now that you're a redneck, you better do something with it. 